Hello friends. So today we will discuss how to use Visual Studio Code. Okay, and uh, how to use um, uh, Terraform in Visual Studio Code. Okay. And last class we have installed uh, Terraform in Uber, uh, in Windows system. Okay. So now I'll show you how to install uh, this uh, Visual Studio Code. Okay. So here this is the URL to download uh, Visual Studio Code. So yeah, once you click on uh, here, you will, it is, now it is downloading, right? So once it will be downloaded, then what you can do is, you can uh, just um, uh, install it, okay? Install it, okay? As I have just downloaded it. So I just double clicked on that. Let me wait for some time. Now it will ask you the, uh, uh, license agreement so here here what we need to do you just need to accept the agreement that's it now click on next again okay this is the thing now you need to click on install okay now it is installing let us wait until it will install Yes, now it is installed successfully. It is finished. So you need to click on finish. Then you need we need to launch Visual Studio. So now it is already launched here. Okay. Now what you can do is okay. So uh, to run uh, Terraform. Okay. So first of all we need to have some command. Okay. So how we can okay so here we need to go to the providers okay so which are providers you want so for example this is our aws uh, we are taking so i'll not explain you today uh, in depth okay so i'll just show you how to use terraform code in uh, visual studio just i'll give you one example that's it okay so here i need to declare the variable okay but here you can see when i'm right now uh, typing the variable here the um auto like auto filling is not coming okay so now what we need to do is we need uh, we need to add some uh, extension okay we need to add some extension to auto fill it okay so that is my agenda for today okay how to do okay so what you need to do here you can see right extension you need to go to here then you need to write for terraform okay okay this is the official one Hashicraft Terraform, you need to click on install. Okay, so now it is installing. Okay, now it is successfully installed. Okay, now what I will do is I will type once again variable. Okay, yeah, see, just a second. Now, that time when I was uh, writing variable, that time the autofill was not coming, but now it is coming. Okay, so what I need to do, I just click on variable. Okay, now. So this is the helpful, right? The, this is the helpful, this auto extension, okay? So that you can, uh, what you can do is, um, if you write any keyword, like resource, variable, or module, it will auto fill, okay? So this is the beauty of this Visual Studio. So this, this was my agenda to show you how to install, okay? So that's it for today's class. On next class onwards, I'll show you how to write the Terraform code to create the VPC and inside those VPC what I'll need we need to create like a subnet those are public subnet private subnet routable and then internet gateway elastic IP then security group EC2 instances everything I'll show you okay and the way I told you right from beginning of the class in my other series also I'll not copy paste okay I'll write one by one command okay I'll explain you so yeah that's it for today's class so thank you so much